Hello there, it's Jeff Barton. It's your Tuesday briefing. It's Tuesday the 11th of July. I'm here in London, so we've got Westminster Abbey back there, Houses of Parliament kind of back there, Central Methodist Hall uh, kind of back there. But you know all the geography of London, I think. I still get a, a buzz about it. Three really quick things. So first of all, you never quite know what to expect in leadership, do you? But all, all I wanted to say to Kathleen and the whole team at Tewkesbury School yesterday is no one would expect to have to deal with what you had to deal with yesterday. And by all accounts, what you did was remarkable. And just to say all of our thoughts from all of us at Haskell uh, are with you and the utter professionalism of, of you and your team. Secondly, Leicestershire schools break up at the end of this week. Northern Ireland schools have broken up. We need you to remember the importance of that ballot if you are in England, if you need an extra ballot paper because yours is stuck in somebody else's pigeonhole in, instead of yours, that will take time because it's not down to us to do that. We have to do it through the independent scrutineer. But we just have to send out a message that here in this place, particularly, they don't talk enough about education. Education doesn't seem to matter enough. Well, frankly, to this generation of teachers and leaders, it really does matter. And the way we demonstrate that is that apathy is not an option. We return that ballot paper. We just need you to do that. And I know we, we're really relentlessly reminding you of that. Could you just get that and post it to us? And we'd be really grateful for all of that. And then finally, having said how education matters, uh, this time last week, I was uh, just further up there actually, joined the NEU rally with my colleague Paul Whitener from the NEHT. Greetings were sent from the NASUWT. I mean, all credit to the current Secretary of State. She's done one thing, hasn't she? She has united the teaching profession. Quite, quite, quite extraordinary. But um, just after that, I got a message from someone saying, Dear Mr B, very inspired by what you said on the stage at the rally last week. It reminded me of your assemblies when I was in year nine. Thank you so much. I, I'll take that as praise, I think. Look, as always, if you need us for something, you get in touch. Great seeing CEOs at our first cohort of our executive leadership programme yesterday. And I was just reminded of the optimism, but also sense of mission that you exude day by day. That doesn't get into the media. We see it. And if you need support in all that mission that you're doing, you know where we are. But otherwise, we will regroup with you on Friday. All the best for the rest of this week.